Hi, Gemini, getting ready to do your reading. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. All right, so universe, what does Gemini need to know at this time? Gemini. The moon. So you may be dealing with the Pisces, but more than likely there's confusion. Two of Wands. Interesting, it's in reverse. Five of Wands. Okay, so there could be some confusion about what to do next, um, who to believe. But yet, Two of Wands is in reverse, so it's almost to me either you don't want to make a, re a decision at all, or you have made one, but yet you're second-guessing yourself, or you don't know all the details. Okay, there's a fire sign, Queen of Wands, and the sun. <clears throat> Page of Swords in reverse, this is why. There could be some lies and gossip around you. There could be someone trying to confuse you. It could be a fire sign. It could be a female in this instance, or a male. But um, Death, Reverse, Emperor... Seven of Wands. Someone is, I feel like someone is confusing you. Someone is saying things to you to keep you around. There could be some lies, gossip, page of swords is in reverse, but it's with the moon. So someone doesn't want to be alone. Five of coin in reverse with the death in reverse. It could be this emperor. So let me do another row. The devil's in reverse, so lies could be coming out. The magician, the fortune's in reverse, page of cups is in reverse, lovers in, is in reverse. Okay, towers under the deck. This is saying here that someone around you is basically being deceitful. They're confusing you. They're telling you things that are not true so that you will stay with them and not move forward. You may manifest staying with them or love with this person, but they're not the right one for you. They are the lovers in, in reverse. This person may be very protective of their life, like they don't bring you to their place. They don't let you know what they're doing. They're very secretive is kind of what I'm feeling, but they have a hidden agenda. This is not a good person who's around you. The devil's in reverse. Could be a Capricorn. Um... Four of Cups, because they're really not offering you anything. There's a Four of Cups in reverse. You're going to invest, looks like, in the same situation, this person, when you shouldn't be. Six of Coin is in reverse. Not giving. It's one-sided. Hangman is in reverse, and the Star is in reverse. Some of you... It's like you're investing in the wrong thing because you don't have hope for finding someone new or you don't have hope that your love life will work out. So some of you, this may be as simple as going back to the past or someone's coming back to you. Um, this could be someone is trying to get you to invest in the past, in them, in the relationship, but it's one-sided. You have the Nine of Wands, the Hierophant, the Nine of Swords is in reverse, the Three of Wands, and the Three of Coin in reverse. Okay. Um, whoever you're dealing with, whoever this person is that's around you, this is not new love. This is someone you already know. This is, um, you're confused. You've got a lot of people either telling you things or you just don't know the truth anymore because you're, you're so overwhelmed. That's kind of what I'm thinking here. This person is not going to work with you. Three of Coin in reverse. Three of Wands upright. There could be other people involved in this, but I'm not too worried about that. It could be this fire sign, though. May, that might be why she's showing up. Maybe there is a third party. But someone is basically wanting to get back together with you after you guys have been through a lot. They put you through a lot. And it, it almost looks like you're going to give them another chance because um, I know you care about them, but it's confusing. You might have a child with them. But you want to do the right thing and you don't want to give up too quickly. But they're not going to put the effort in. You might find out about a third party later. But three point reverse is about people not working together, not trying, you know, having the same goal in mind. Three of coin. Four of wands, making a happy home. Ace of Swords in reverse, Queen of Swords in reverse, Eight of Cups in reverse, yeah. So it's almost as if, like this is what I'm kind of feeling. Now what's funny is the Ace of Cups is under the deck now. After I pulled the Three of Coin, I saw the Ace of Cups was the next card, but I didn't want to pull it because I didn't need it. I didn't want to keep going there. There's new love for you guys. If you guys would not stay in this situation, you could meet someone new, no problem. This person may make you believe that you can't find someone new if you... Somebody has children and you feel like, gosh, I don't have time to date. No one want to date me. I have too many kids, etc. That's not true. 
It's almost like you're putting the effort in to make it a happy home, four of wands. Now you don't have to have kids with them. You don't have to have a home with them. It's just symbolic of trying to make, make the relationship stable. But we have this queen of swords in reverse, the ace of swords. There is somebody in here, this relationship who does not want a second chance or does a third chance, doesn't want to fix it, change it, make the changes they need to make in order to make this relationship better. This might be you, but again, they're not walking away. Eight of Cups is in reverse. So it's like two people aren't working together. They don't have the same end goal. I feel a lot of confusion. Things are being said and done that aren't really true. So it might be giving someone another chance because you already have kids together or home together. So instead of uh, creating tower energy, it could be that this person also cheated. Someone hasn't let that go. If there was 30 third party situations here, someone did not let it go. They may have said, okay, I forgive and forget moved on. They did not, but I don't blame them. So it could be hard to get over that. So anyways, not walking, not walking forward when, when this, you have love showing up in the deck, trying to come out. It's not here now because it can't, it can't come through, which I don't know. seems like people find someone even when they're in relationships. So why, why do you have to get out of something old? Maybe this person knows you're with this person. Maybe they know you're trying to give it a second chance or a third chance. So they don't want to get involved. They don't want to get in your way. But I do, let me put one more row down to see what's going on here. It's kind of a jumbled relation, uh, reading because I think the relationship is jumbled. The energy around the two of you is jumbled. It's very kind of chaotic. But someone I feel is ready to let it go. I'm assuming this is definitely your energy. I think you're kind of fed up with it. Eight of swords, yeah, releasing yourself. Knight of coin in reverse, temperance in reverse, losing patience. Four of swords, taking some time for yourself. But the fool's in reverse and you have a king of wands and a six of cups in reverse. Okay. You have a king of coin under there too. Okay. Because I don't think we have any kings here except for the emperor was here because I didn't really see a specific person. See, the knight of coin is in reverse. When he's upright, he's still not really moving. Very slow energy. But in reverse, he's not really moving forward. And that's the fool in reverse also. I feel like you guys are fed up with this situation. You want to release, release yourself from it. You want to move forward. Temperance in reverse. You're tired of waiting. This is showing me a, a fire sign coming in. They gave me the six of cups in reverse to tell me this is not someone from the past. So if you were dealing with a fire sign, if you know a fire sign, this is not the same fire sign. This is someone new. So as I'm saying, there's new love coming in and it's not someone old, but you're not even really kind of stuck because if he was upright, I think, okay, you guys want to move forward, but you ha you're not really moving. So that's why your fool's also in reverse. In reverse is kind of like you're still looking backwards. You're standing still, but looking back over your shoulder at the same time. But yet you're frustrated, and I can see that. So if you took, well, I don't want to say take the leap of faith. I mean, what does that really mean? We need to have a plan, I think, and to just keep telling people to take that leap of faith, to just walk away, to do this and that, I think is kind of, you know, crazy. Who wants to do that? You need a plan of action, but maybe that's what the four of swords is. Put it together. How can you end this one situation so you can move on to something new? This new relationship, someone who's not from your past. You don't know this person. It's brand new. Under the deck, you do have this king of coin. So you may be dealing with an earth sign. He is in reverse. He is, he or she, I should say she more. I'm sorry. He or she may be very stingy. It's all about them. It's what they want. And that's what this whole reading's about. They are gaslighting you they may be lying to you a page of swords in reverse moon confusing you and so that could be the whole energy of this reading because it does feel a little bit like i said chaotic and dramatic and it's causing me to want to just like rush through it and so you may need to four swords it slow down rest for a moment get your thoughts together make a plan because there is definitely in showing up here something someone new that you could you could have in your life definitely i'm gonna leave it there gemini have a great week you guys and take care